This is the D780. This is a full frame DSLR. It has a 51 point autofocus system when looking through the viewfinder. When using live view, you have a 273 point phase detect autofocus system. That means we can bring a lot of the technology that we have in our Z series cameras into our DSLR. This makes the D780 a fantastic all-rounder because we get all the benefits of having a DSLR body and the weight and the balance. Plus we have some of the technology from our Z series mirrorless cameras, which makes shooting video and having things like face and eye detect when using live view, just incredible to work with and makes your life very easy to track focus and moving subjects. One of the other great things you can do with the D780 is if you want to get a real-time white balance of your scene rather than relying on auto, which is very, very good, is to switch the camera into a live view like this. And now if you hold in the white balance button here, the WB button, and you now just rotate the dial here, you will get a real-time white balance of the actual scene. If you want to dial in a automatic white balance, that's fine. Or you could put in, say, a Kelvin number here and I've got about 5,000K. If I hold my front button now, I'll rotate that through and sort of 5,560 Kelvin is sort of my standard go-to Kelvin number there to get me a consistent Kelvin. So that's a great trick. Live view, white balance, giving you a real-time white balance as you're actually seeing the scene. One of the new features on the D780 is the ability to go beyond 30 seconds. We have now offered the feature of having pre-programmed shutter speeds down to 900 seconds if you're in manual mode. This makes long exposure photography really easy. To set this up, press the menu button, go into the custom settings menu, which is the pencil symbol, go to D, shooting and display, go to D, six extended shutter speeds manual mode and now turn that on now when we press our info button as you can see I'm in manual mode and as I adjust my shutter speed you'll see that I can actually now go to a range of pre-programmed shutter speeds all the way down to 900 seconds one of the other new features on the D780 and a first for a Nikon DSLR is the ability now to be able to program the eye menu. To customize the eye menu, press menu, go into custom settings, which is the pencil symbol, go to controls, and then you have the option of using F1 or F2, depending on whether you want to customize it when you're using live view or when you're looking through the optical viewfinder. If you go into F1, for example, I now have a range of boxes and I can personalize the settings in any of these boxes depending on the features I use the most or the features that will make my life easier as a photographer. So this is a great way of really personalizing the camera to make it very easy to shoot pictures very, very quickly. The D780 builds on the heritage from the D750. It's 25 megapixels, ISO 100 to 51,200, and it's expandable over a million ISO if you really need the best shooting capability and light gathering capability in low light situations. You can also shoot a range of time-lapse features, and you've got 4K movies. This is the best Nikon DSLR for shooting movies due to the face detect autofocus system which enables you to have face detection when you're shooting your movies.